<gasps> hey, Mom! Hi, Martin. Are you on your way home? Sure are. <laughs> yeah, no problems here. We'll be home in time for Mother's Day, all right. Remember, you can bring your laundry, as long as there are no jungle bugs in it. No problem, Mom. Don't worry. It won't be like uh, last time when those Amazon cockroaches got loose in the house. <laughs> oh, good. I can't wait to see my boys. Bye, Mom. Phew. It's not every day you get to Madagascar. Who knows when we'll be able to get back here. Fusa sure must be amazing in the trees to be able to catch lemurs. I mean, they'll catch anything they can, but more than half of what they eat is lemurs. How do they do it? Who knows when we'll find out. So what did you guys get your moms for Mother's Day? I got mine this sundress from a stop in Indonesia. I made mine a pizza sculpture from shells I found on the beach. I invented a banana slicer for mine. Cool. What about you, Martin? Uh, well, I, uh... He forgot. You forgot? Well, I, uh... <sighs> yeah, I forgot. I can't show up for Mother's Day without a present, can I? Uh-uh. No way. I didn't think so. Oh, no. A present. I still don't have a present for Mom. <gasps> Me neither. Oh, no. There's got to be something we can... Hey, you again. <gasps> That's it. A hissing cockroach. Oh, Mom's going to love you. Yes. And I've got a deluxe terrarium right here. He'll be Mom's pet till we can find a way to get him back to Madagascar. Perfect. Oh, and you are going to love Mom's cooking. Yeah, and best of all, we made it home for Mother's Day. Mom, we're home! A baby doll! Oh, it must be. Yeah, and you look dog-like, but different. Kind of a dog and kind of not, so you must be a doll. Oh, yeah. One thing's for sure, I'm going to name you Little Red. Uh, I think we have our answer on the doll question. She's definitely a doll cub, because there's her mom. Hi, Mama Doll. Wow, that's a doll. Oh, an amazing new animal for my life list. The doll, Quan Alpinus. Really kind of small and a little long. Looks kind of like a mix between a weasel and a dog. Oh, and totally fearless. Where are you going? And why the hurry? Uh, I don't think Mom is too happy with us. We don't want to hurt your pup. Ah. What's she doing? There's nothing there. Uh, you were saying, bro? Looks like a leopard to me. Those leopards can hide anywhere. One of the stealthiest of all the world's wildcats. Uh-oh, this is bad. This leopard is going for the mother dole. Uh, and may I remind you that sometimes leopards are man-eaters? So this isn't very good for us either. Oh, Martin, how can such a little carnivore be so brave? That's out, bro. The pack. Oh, oh, yeah. Of course. Power in numbers. These little carnivores are fluid, fearless, and energetic. And together, they are a force to be reckoned with. Wow, that's some serious teamwork. Oh, what a creature power. Aviva, Aviva, are you getting this? Oh yeah, all over this. Quick, agile, confident, sleek, fast, intelligent. Individually, an amazing animal. 
together, one big super predator. Well, this is going to be a great mother and baby reunion moment. There! Ah, surprising stallions! Oh. Ow! You caught me. You gotta dance, Martin! Dance? I'm not really in the mood for dancing. The stallion dance! Oh, you mean the parallel prance. I know that one. But this guy is pretty tough. You've got to be confident, Martin! Don't let him psych you out! Okay, okay. <laughs> but he's not backing down! Stand up to him! How about this move? <laughs> oh. Ow! He bites! Whoa! 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 Oh. <gasps> oh, Mom and Fool! Back together again! Aww, he's so cute! And he's so happy to be back with his mom. Ugh. Well, that's a creature mission accomplished. Yeah, Spooky is back in the safety of the band. Living free and in the wild. There's your mama. Aw, Shadow is back where he belongs. Living free and with his mom. <laughs> Living free and in the shadows. <laughs> Living free and in, in the wild. wild. Crunch, SWAT! Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> I can't believe it. A rarely seen battle between a Florida panther and an alligator. Gators will sometimes eat young panthers. And panthers will sometimes eat young gators. But standoffs like these usually end in a draw. She saved her cubs! Mama Panther to the rescue! And look! She even came with dinner! Looks like our cub sitting job is over! And here's our pickup! Found ya! Bye, Swan! Bye, Crunch! Mission accomplished! We found the rare Florida Panther! Awesome predator of the swamp! And we even helped them out a little bit. Yeah! Mom's leg is looking a lot stronger. <laughs> Look, Crunch and Swat are so happy to have her back. Here's Mama. Whoa! I never thought I'd be so happy to see that face. Uh, on second thought... You, oh, these crocodiles! Just when I was starting to trust them! It's fine. She's not eating them. She's just picking them up. She knows how sharp her teeth are, so she's super careful. Huh? Martin! It's comfy in here, too. <laughs> her throat pouch holds 20 of us. She's even taking the baby turtles. That's nice of her. Okay, I think we got a full load. Bus is packed and ready to go. But where are you guys going? To the water! Full crock ahead! <sighs> I can't believe it. Now I'm totally blown away. Crock moms are... are... <laughs> we know. They freak you out. No! They're the coolest! What kind of mom is more dedicated, more committed? They're amazing! Okay. First and only stop. The crash. That's a fancy word for the nursery pool. A nice, calm, quiet section of the river. Everybody out! Oh, 
Oh, hey, everybody's looking good. You know, baby crocs are expert swimmers from the minute they're born. And Mama's off to get the rest of the kid crocs. We'll keep an eye on these ones for you. Uh, Jimmy, can you pass me those rivets? What are you working on anyway? Oh, it's a... Oh, no! We've got a problem! What? That! <gasps> You. Look who's back! Oh, these monitor lizards don't only like eggs. They think baby crocs are pretty tasty, too. You've got to fill in for Crocodilla. Be a mother croc and get those meanies. Aviva, I thought you thought crocs were the meanies. Are you kidding me? She's just protecting her babies. Crocs are great. Now help them quick! We can't fill in for a mama croc. We don't have a crocodile disc for our creature power suits. Unless this'll work. Aviva made a disc with Gary old croc power when we were adventuring in Asia, remember? Since they're both crocodilians, it just might work. Activate creature power suit! Whoa! Come on, come on! Yes, it worked! Sorry, a couple more mama crocs just showed up. To the baby crocodile rescue! Okay then. Martin! No! But Chris, I was just gonna ask you the same thing. Why? Because we're sinking right towards underwater volcanoes! And they're active. <gasps> but the squid just chewed off one of my fins! But I'm drifting straight into a pool of bubbling lava! Ah, his spinning hooks are shredding my back! A volcano's erupting! Chewing through the glass! Giant gas-filled rocks hurtling towards me! <gasps> Giant gas-filled rocks hurtling towards me! Oh, gotcha! Whoa! Going up! Hang on, Mama Whale! Hurry! When he's done destroying my whale suit, he's gonna devour me! Uh... Excuse me, your colossalness. Uh, don't you know it's not nice to eat creature rescuers? <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, I got no strength to fight back. She's almost torn through my suit. The sperm whale has only five minutes of air. It's too deep for us to help you. Did anybody say, uh-oh? No, stay away, Bumper. Save yourself. Oh, what a buddy. He's trying to save us with a little boom clip. Whoa! Bumper, was that you? I don't think so. Only one creature could do that. The loudest animal on Earth. A full-grown full bull sperm whale. whale! A direct hit from his boom click could knock down a small house. It totally stunned the colossal squid. He's bigger than an 18-wheeler truck. The biggest tooth predator in the history of planet Earth. A battle between a colossal squid and a bull sperm whale. A face-off between the largest eye and the biggest brain in the creature world. Go! Hang in there, Mom! We're heading to air! Are they? Whoa! Yes! She made it! Now that was a whale of a rescue! Deactivate! Let's get you out of this ghost net. <laughs> Looks like Bumper's happy to have his mom back. Aviva, we found Thornsley's mom. She's stuck in a mud wallow and the rest of the herd can't get her out. We need elephant creature power suits, fast! I'm almost done with your discs. Two minutes and you'll have it. Look, Martin, even Thornsley's trying to save her. Uh-oh, he could get stuck in the mud too. Thornsley, wait! Oh no, he's stuck too. 
to the Thornsley Rescue! Hey, you look pretty cool as a mud man. You too, bro. <laughs> Aviva, we need the elephant discs. I've never worked so fast, but they're ready to go. Jimmy is teleporting them now. It's okay, little guy. You'll be back with your mom in a flash. Ah, like I said, in a flash. Stick around, buddy. We'll need you to activate our suits. To the Creature Rescue! Okay, you grab her trunk with your trunk and pull. I'll do the pushing, Martin. Not bad for a fake elephant. Pull, Martin, pull! Oh, it's working, Chris! We're moving her! Yes! I knew we could do it! Oh, oh no, this stuff is thick! She's stuck again! Guys, we're around the corner. We can help push her out. We're gonna need all the help we can get. Hurry! Don't worry, Thorns' mom. We're gonna get you out. Wait, stop, buddy! We don't want you to get stuck in the mud again. <laughs> Jimmy, keep an eye on him. I'm on it. Oh! Ugh. Thanks, Thornsley. I wanted a mud mask today. Okay, guys, you're hooked up. Go, Aviva! Ow! Ow! She stepped on my foot! Ugh. Oh, it's working! Woohoo! Yeah! You did it! Thornsley and his mom are back together. <laughs> Way to go, Elephant Bros! Now that sounds like one happy herd of elephants. Well, it took all day, but we finally found Mom. And in the meantime, we learned... More than enough to get me going on programming red panda powers! Yeah! For starters, Red pandas are a great looking creature with that red orange fur, plus the white face marking and rings on the tail. They're a pretty agile tree climber. Oh, and they like to climb down tree trunks head first. They like to eat lots of bamboo. And red pandas are very rare with only 10,000 living in the wild. And they're in their own unique family. Iluridae. So because they're so unique, it might take me a while to program this particular red panda power suit. <gasps> red, red panda, panda powers? powers? Oh, don't worry. We're not going anywhere. We can wait. See, I told you they'd want to stay in wild China forever. <laughs> <laughs> We've fallen into some kind of chasm. Yeah. Not so bad, really. <gasps> what? That cheetah chirp. It's coming from down here. Blur! She must have fallen into the chasm. But we found her. Ha <laughs> ha, we did it. Creature mission accomplished.